And welcome back. It is National Candy Day. Exciting or what? Yes. Yes, exactly. Yes. And, and we're going to try our hand at pretzel turtles. Simple. Well, for you it will be simple. Me, not so much. <laughs> we're going to start off by showing you the recipe. All right. Now, you need, it's just a mere three ingredients. That's, we can do this, can't we, Tammy? I think so. All right. A bag of caramel chocolates, salty pretzel squares, and pecan halves, okay? So you can see we've, we've, we've got them right here. There's the pretzel squares and the pecans, or pecans <laughs> if you prefer. And then, there you go, that's the caramel chocolate kind of candies. Yeah. Yes. All right. Okay. Now, the recipe itself is, again, really simple. All right? First, preheat your oven to 300 degrees, then line an 18 by 13 inch baking sheet with parchment paper. Lay your pretzels in a single layer on the baking sheet, then place one candy in the center of each pretzel. Warm these in the preheated oven just until the chocolate and caramel candies have softened. That should take about four minutes. From there, remove your baking sheet from the oven. Remember to wear oven mitts. You have oven mitts? No. Okay. Then press one pecan into each candy. Then you transfer the baking sheet to refrigerator and chill until the chocolate has set and store in an airtight container at room temperature, preferably in a single layer. The chocolate softens up just a little at room temperature. Now, Tammy, you heard that. You got it, you, you've got it, right? I've got it. Okay, now, I want you to start <laughs> assembling these. I'm gonna move these spoons out of the way. Okay. Because they're in the way. So, all right, now I'm you put do that. Oops. All right. Should I do two, one for I, you and one for no, me? I, I think that, at, at least two, at least two. Yeah. Okay, so now you've got the pretzel squares all ready. All well, right. You should be unwrapping those. No, help. this, you're the chef. Oh. I mean, I've seen you cook. No, you have not. She's, that's, I, I never have seen her cook. Okay. Okay, now you've got the, the candies on there. All yeah, right. I got one candy. It's pretty candy. simple. So well, far, yeah. You, but, okay. All right. Now do I squish it down? Well, I would say, why don't you, okay, now do you say pecans or yeah, pecans? I or say pecans. Pecan. Okay. And I look for the big ones. Okay. Okay. Put one on top of each. Do I push, okay, just like that? You do it whatever way you want. Okay. You can okay. have this little one. Now, wait, no, 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 no. Now, of course, what we said was put them in an oven at, you know, 300 degrees. Yeah. And if you notice. We don't have an oven. We don't have an oven. So are you going to blow on it? But, no. Here, hold that. Okay. So, <laughs> what, you, <laughs> what we tried is we tried putting them in the microwave. Yes. Okay, because we don't have the oven. Right. Oven is the preferred way, but. Here, I'm gonna I'm gonna go into the microwave here. Okay. Now, these, if you can get a shot of that, this is kind of following the recipe and you know, putting the, the pretzel and then putting the chocolate or the caramel and then putting the pecan on top. And then put them in the microwave and you know, do like 30 second increments. I wouldn't go beyond that. Okay. And just kind of let it melt. Now this I said, you know it'd be a good idea because turtles have the pecans inside. Okay, I said, why don't you put the pecan on first and then melt it? Now they may ch they may taste the same, but these are really ugly ways. So we're gonna go with the recipe of putting the pecan on second. All right, Tammy, let's go. We're gonna taste these. Okay. We're gonna taste these. Oh, mine. Okay. Ready? Yeah. There we go. Good, cheers. Uh, cheers. Cheers. All right. I, I like, like it. this. <laughs> it's very good. Really simple to make, right? Mm -hmm. And they taste great, right? You ready? Coming up next. Oh, well, yeah. I'm not really ready. No, I'm not.